Do your recycling, guys. Even if you think the government mixes it all. What's going on, you guys? My name's Candice. Welcome back to the channel. If you're new, welcome. If you're not new, welcome. Finished the usual protein muffin breakfast. Ugh. Running a little late today, I will be getting up to some stuff in the city. A doctor's appointment, picking up a present for a friend whose birthday is coming up. Okay, I'm getting late now, so we better run. So I thought I'd do a little voiceover this time around, just to try a different type of style of video. I love being around old city buildings and just looking at the different types of personalities behind architecture and stuff. It's always really nice to see different events going on in the city and I ended up going to my first stop of the day which was Area 52. Hello. Hey, how are you? Good. A local shop that sells books and board games and all sorts of pop culture, comic type things in between. I love going in and just browsing. They have tons of graphic novels that are super, super inspiring and all sorts of obscure titles that you wouldn't really think to find at all and they are all so colourful and amazing. It's also a really, really entertaining shop with heaps and heaps of personality and I love going in there just to browse whenever I have a little bit of time in my hands. I picked up the card game that I was going to give my friend and afterwards I was off to my doctor's appointment. This was just a regular health check and I ended up having to get an x-ray done too, which was kind of fun in winter. <laughs> By the time I was done, I was already super super hungry from being out and about all day, so I ended up having this coconut almond crisp protein bar that I packed along with me while waiting for my bus back home and it was so so yummy it was coated in dark chocolate and it was well worth the wait <laughs> after that I made my way home and I managed to catch this gorgeous gorgeous sunset to round off the day out welcome back I'm gonna whip up some dinner really quick noodles Miso, zucchini, frozen veg, I'm forgetting something, pickles, and some chicken that's already been prepped. Using being Asian to my advantage, throwing whatever random seasonings and things I have in the fridge left into a pan for dinner. And it's just a good way to use up all sorts of random shmish mash stuff that you have left over. Miso is really good for your gut health also. It's fermented soybean pain in the ass to weigh out. Ugh. Recently, I've just been obsessed with adding pickles on top of whatever dish that I have. It's kind of an old person food, but I think I'm just really living for that sudden hit of sodium. Yummy! Seasors! Perfect! Mm. These are the noodles I'll be using tonight. These are just regular old rice noodles. I'm gonna rinse them off really quick. <coughs> and... Okay, into the pot before we add on everything else. Separate the noodles a little. If they are stuck together, it kind of it kind of cooks together too, and your strands are just gonna get like thick and yeah. Pot. I'm gonna be extra and add in some mixed herbs, a little multicultural, and miso in. We'll Simmer it down ish. My rice noodles. I should really do this with two hands. If you don't want it as a stir fry, add more miso paste in and go at it with and fill the pot up with water. That way if it's really cold outside or if you just want something a little bit more hearty and warm, that this is like the ultimate cheap ramen hack. 
don't come at me because I know this isn't <laughs> this isn't how traditional ramen is made and this is not by any means accurate. Added my frozen veggie simmer for a little while more before stirring through my chicken because it's already been cooked. Should I do a magical transition? Okay, ready? They're all nice and done. All the way at the bottom we've got our nudes! Pickles on the side. Actually, complete this circle. Oi. Oi. Beautiful. I'll wash all of this down with three cups of tea. <laughs> I am an addict. No onion salt salt. Excelente. For dessert, I just made up some jello last night. This one's vanilla berry flavor. Something I've also been enjoying to round off my evenings is a nice hot drink. It's caramelized white chocolate drink and it's actually so beautiful. It looks like glistens because there's stevia in it and it just looks so so magical. Hot water which is magically ready because that is how the YouTubes work. I'm only only and I'm only gonna go till halfway just so I can mix in vanilla flavored almond milk. Ooh. Alrighty, that's it for me. Thank you guys so much for coming along with me today. I hope you enjoy the video. I will see you guys soon.